Hi everybody, I'm back and I'm redoing a quick review, hopefully quick, on my favorites for October. I know it's a little late, but it's better late than ever. So, I have a lot of Christmas stuff, so let's get going. So, I just reviewed my Grinch duvet and I was thought, what better than a favorite for Christmas than my Grinch sheets. So, I thought, in case you guys forgot what they look like, Here's what they are. I went and grabbed them out of the linen closet. These are a lot bigger. Yeah, but they will be darling. And then I have a white quilt with little puff balls on top of it. That'll be really cute. Really, really cute. I know it's hard to show you what they look like. Um, but yeah, they're just really bright. Um, they're really soft. Yeah, so I have a Christmas set with Santa and white snowflakes for the other bed in case my mom comes. Not sure what's going to happen with my neck. If we have to have surgery during Christmas, we will just get the house stocked up, get it ready, and just do what we have to do. So just go with the flow. Anyway, um, I have bone spurs in my from arthritis. I have bone spurs from C1 through C6 and they're poking through my neck so they would basically have to go in through my through the front of my throat, flip me over and fillet me and go down in through the back. Yeah, scary. So I just went through a hip surgery. I know I haven't talked to you guys much about my medical issues and I just, I don't know, I will talk to you guys more about it. Why not you guys are part of my life, so I might as well start telling you a little bit more about what's going on in my life. Anyway, so here is the, this is the Grinch flannel uh, pillowcase. I'll put them all in one. Oh, there's pillowcases. Now here are the flannel sheets. They are so stinking heavy. Now see, see what I mean, how the sheets are a lot bigger. They're really cute. Um, and I went to Pottery Barn and I spent two or three dollars, two hundred, two or three hundred dollars because I could not find a down comforter that would fit one of their duvets perfectly. They have ties on the inside and, um, it's just, it doesn't beat it because all of my down comforters, even if they were Ralph Lauren from Macy's, my mom used to work there, is I would still have this much hanging fabric hanging on each side and I just got tired of it. So I went to Pottery Barn, I said, Are these measured exactly? And she said, Yes, you need to you need to lay it out on the floor and put it in, tie each corner, fluff it out, and you will see. I'll do a tutorial on that. Because a lot of people can't seem to get their duvets in right and they just look awful and you have to you have to tie the corners you just have to because as you're sleeping they just slide down and I want a bed that I can just flop over you know I really want a bed where I can just although it's going to ruin the duvet where I can just have a flat sheet and then the duvet but that just means that when you wash your sheets every week you're going to have to wash your duvet every week and your duvet is going to get you know bleached out so Anyway, we shall see. You don't wear, you don't use your Christmas sheets all year, so um, I just think it would be a lot more comfortable. You wouldn't have to mess with a sheet, you know, under there. You would just get in your bed, and you've got your duvet over you, which is flannel. You get what I mean. So yeah, there's that. So yeah, really cute set. It's all here. I just cannot get over these. These are so cute. I have got to take one out. I have got to take one out. And then I'm going to do a really quick bath. Bath, uh, always in my favorites. Then I've got a Bomb Your Body candle. She makes these herself. They are amazing. You must get on her website and order some. They last forever. Right now I'm burning a candy cane. Her packaging is darling. She is a sweet lady. Her name is Anne. And let me blow it out. But if you can see without spilling the wax, she puts little hearts. And yeah, she puts little hearts. Really, really 
Oh, and it's just spot on. This is a candy cane. I just love it. She is a sweetheart. She will go out of her way for whatever you need. And she sent these to me as a birthday gift. That was very sweet of her. I ordered one of them. Now, there's one in the bedroom. I didn't grab it. It's really cute. Now, this one came melted because I ordered it dummy. It was 110 out. So, she sent me another one. But this one is fabulous. It smells wonderful. This is Snowberry Cupcakes. You can see where the oils are leaking through. That's how amazing this cup, this, um, oh my gosh, I can't even explain it. It is fabulous. I just, I said, I don't know how you do it. This one is Chili Willy Bomb Cosmetics. Let it glow. And look at the packaging. How cute is that? So these are my favorites for October. See how she puts little um, hearts and sparkles. And this one smells like, um, it doesn't say, it smells a lot like peppermint. Yeah. Reminds me of Christmas though. This one is really cute. This is Santa's Little Melter. Really, really cute. Now she is in Germany or the UK, but you can just go to Bomb Your Cosmetics. I think it's dot com dot UK. Um, if you have any problems, get back to me. She has an awesome website. I have a bunch of her bath products down here. Anthony's in bed. I can't go and get them out of the jetted tub, but here's another one. This one isn't how cute is that? These burn for 50 hours because it has one wick. It's got a little bit of glitter in there. So this one is Sandwich Santa's Little Helper. Ho ho ho. And this just smells fresh and clean and smells like Christmas. So yeah, I have them for right now. For right now, I have them in my China Hutch. So there's those. Now this is another favorite. I know I don't want to skip them. Now. now that we're on the sheets, I'm gonna pull this um this out. It is just Killing me, this Grinch. I want to show you the the. Uh, this is the sham. I want to show you the sham that goes over the duvet. It is so cute. I haven't seen it myself. Um, so yeah, lost my pain doctor. Not a good thing. It was. He said it was due to insurance. I don't know, but something. God opens one door, he, like my husband says, he opens one door and he closes another. So something will work out. If it doesn't, I don't know what I'm going to do. So anyway. Oh, nice headlight shining right in my vlogging room. I my, Tomorrow I'm going to hang some curtains up in here. And yeah, I'm going to paint the, I'm, I think I'm going to start with the bathroom. The main bathroom. Because when you have a man around and you try and wash the walls behind the toilet, I was mopping and cleaning it. And the, oh, another review I'm going to do is that scrubbing bubbles. It is amazing. We dry our shower every day, and that stuff is amazing. I will do if I can do a review tonight. I will. I'll probably do it tomorrow. You just spray it on. It's fresh. It smells really good. It bubbles up, and then you just rinse it off and dry it. And it, you have no water spots. It's amazing. You can use it in toilets. Anyway, how cute is that? Oh my gosh. Look at that. So that's the duvet. Really, really cute. Oh my gosh. Yeah. If you wouldn't have sweet dreams on that, I don't know. And the back is just as cute. So that is the duvet. And then. I'm not quite sure why the pillow, why the um, sheets are a lot bigger. You know what I'm saying? So I will fold this up later. It's a very large, but the flannel just feels really, really soft. Okay, so let's get to bath products. Let's do candles real quick. Um, I will fold this up in a minute. I've got flocking all over my blogging room. I had it cleaned. Um, and then I have to review that Jimmy Choo for Anthony. I'm going to do a lot of my shopping online just because of my health. And it's easier just to buy it online. 
can have it delivered here, wrap it, and it's done. Because I can't, I, I feel bad making him pay for my medical issues and having, I'm still going to cook him for Thanksgiving dinner if it takes everything in me. But I'm not going to make him suffer because of something wrong with my health. So, anyway. There it is. Really, really cute. They should have packaged it like that. So that is the sham. Okay. And then I'll just show you one more time. This is the difference in the size of the sheets. Yeah, they're just a lot bigger, the pictures. But it'll be darling. Okay, so there is the Grinch set. Okay, now let's move to... Now, I have not bought the entire launch set, uh, entire Lush set. Let's do Feeling Smith and Real Fit. And then I bought a huge, ginormous, um, uh, through Instagram, and it's called, I think it's called Butter Your Bath. Yeah, I'd hate to get it wrong. She really supports bloggers, and she will give you, yeah, it's called Butter Body Bakery. Um, I'll have to check my email. So anyway, this one is from Feeling Smitten. Um, this is more of like a moisturizing. Um, this is one of their Christmas um, launches. And this is called Blackberry Bumpkin. So there it is. Wrapped it up. Wrapped up perfect gift for a teacher, friend, just a simple gift. Um, okay, here's another Feeling Smitten limited edition. This is a cherry daiquiri. And I've got two more glass bowls in the bedroom. I didn't want to wake Anthony up, so I will go over those tomorrow. Here's another Feeling Smitten. This is a Petty. This is a ice cream vanilla bath milk coconut vanilla and this is like a um it's supposed to be I guess it's just a bath bomb so it's shaped like ice cream cone really cute really really cute so there's that and then she sent me this this was free the little gingerbread man I wanted the set of two I'll have to get back on and I just love gingerbread man I love them I think they're cute darling I'm not quite sure what it's made out of. It looks a little kind of crunchy, but I've never gotten anything bad out of, out of their company. It smells fabulous. So, and then Feeling Smitten did not have any more apple. That was what the one I wanted. They sent me a message and they said they had tangerine. I said no problem. So here's their tangerine soap. It smells fabulous. Haven't even opened it. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. I'll probably put it in the kitchen. Where else would you smell tangerine soap? So, fabulous. Okay, and then here she sent me, I asked her if she could send me a peppermint um, scrub. And she did, bless her heart. And I hope it's in this. I brought my, I don't think it is. I just grabbed this out of the shower, my pink shower caddy, where I keep all of my bath products. And I don't see it in the dresser. So, anyway, that one is Mimosa. She sent me this one too. This is a sugar brulee, and it comes with a little scraper. I haven't opened it yet, but it's good to exfoliate. It just gets all that stuff dead skin off of you just take a scoop out and just you know take it and rub it on your skin and then put lotion on so yeah I haven't opened this one yet but it looks about as good as it smells I'm sure so there's a sugar brulee and thank you to Failing Smitten okay and then she sent me this this is really cute I think I ordered this drop in the bath under running water and it says a sweet skin treat. I think I'm going to go jump in the tub after I'm done doing this. So there's that one. That's feeling smitten. Now there's a bunch more in the bedroom. 
I couldn't grab them all because I didn't want to wake Anthony up. So now, <coughs> excuse me. So now we're going to move on to Balm Your Body. And then I'm going to move on to Lush. Now this morning, I found these. I could not believe my eyes. Balm Your Body sent me this, and I was dying. I didn't even thank her. I was like, what am I thinking? Okay, here's another Feeling Smitten. This is for Thanksgiving. How cute is that? It's a little pumpkin. Oh my gosh. Yeah, and you don't see the one gray nail. I'm going to take care of that tomorrow. We're going to go get my nails done. I keep thinking it's Saturday. I will be getting my nails done. Okay, so I'm going to go through the balm your body real quick. No, that's Feeling Smitten. So, this is how I had everything arranged just in the tub, just so I could grab it real quick. Um, you can see, of course, what's lush and what isn't. All this stuff is lush. So, this is all, these are all of her mallows from Feeling Smitten. This is like a lavender. You drop it in, you can leave it in the bag so it doesn't get crud in your tub. It's lavender. This one is sweet, it's pink. It's got a little cupcake. Really, really cute. These are $5. I've got a bazillion of these. I need to use up. This one's got a ladybug on it. You can, for a bigger tub, you need to throw two in. This one smells like wintergreen. It has a little, um, oh, he's so cute. It's got a little snowman. And this one has a little, like, um, toadstool. Really, really, really cute. She has the most creative mind, I tell you what. So then she sent me one with, whoops, one with a button. Really cute. A lot of these I ordered. And then this one is really cute. It's, a, it's got lavender on the bottom, which is not a favorite, but this one made it a favorite. And it's got a little snowman. How cute is that? Okay. This is from Fortune Cookie Soap. Fortune cookie soap from last year. It's still good though. This one is from Mom Your Body. It's just like an ice cream cone. Throw it in. I'm going to start doing more bath cocktails. I need to use these up. You can use two and three at a time. And then I just have a clean mop and I spray the tub down and just mop it real quick. And it's done. Here's a little fairy. Really, really cute. If you can see her, little pink fairy. And then this one is another mallow. And those are just creamers. They make your water creamy. And then she sent me a full. This doesn't collapse. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Okay, so this is a. A Christmas one um, that smells Christmassy. This brown one. Send it in a bag so it wouldn't crumble. I don't want to make this too long. This one, I love her packaging. This one has little flowers on it. It's really, really cute. And you can, if you don't want to um, make your, have your tub be a mess, you can just put this over the water and let it run over it. Or you can put it over the water and just smash it like this and let it, you know, do that. I mean, there's two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, and then there's one more. This one smells awesome. This one is cinnamon. Love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Oh, and she is so talented. Okay, so there's Anne's stuff from, from Bomb, Bomb Cosmetics. If you need the website, let me know. So, this stuff I'm going to leave here for now. Otherwise, it will take me forever to clean up. Okay, so obviously everything here you guys can see is from Lush. Now, they brought these back. They're just a little bit different looking. They're a little bit more kind of shiny, and they're not, they don't have this wood stick. I need to get on and make a big order with Lush. Um, I need to use this stuff first. They didn't bring the bubble beards back, which I wasn't disappointed. This is Little Drummer's Drumming. Um, I don't think they brought this one back. I need to use this up. I think I'm going to cut it up. 
Now, I, do, I used a bubble bar in the tub the other night. I used a quarter, and I had bubbles to the ceiling. It's scary. Yeah. The amount of products that I have, I don't know what I'm going to do. I have so many products, and if I have to use them in quarters... Now, the mallows are fine, but anything bubble, it goes crazy because I had to keep turning the jets on, turning them off because the bubbles were getting closer and closer to the ceiling. And I was like, we do not need a flood. So, that is Lush. Um, and then I will show you what I have left from last year's launch that came back this year. So I'm going to just set this on the ground. I will take care of the ball in your body in a minute. But I wanted to show you, this is from, ooh, I made a mess. Okay, so this one here is Old Fashioned Family Christmas Body Wash, which I got at Christmas in July. It smells fabulous. Love it. it. Smells like everything Christmas. Cranberry, Christmas tree. Love it. Oh, amazing. <clears throat> so I keep it in my little pink tub, wherever that went, down on my feet. Okay. Then I have the snowman from last year. Okay, so I was looking through these today, and I was like, oh my gosh, I didn't even see these in the drawer. She sent me, there's seven, it's crazy, there are seven bars of soap in here. And they smell so good. So this one, it doesn't have a name, or they're in German. But look at this one. It's like that. And then on the back, look. And it smells like... Oh, it smells like baby powder and winter. It's amazing. The two mixture. And this one has little blue dots. It smells like winter. And then you can see on the top it has sparkles. I'll show you my favorite one. You guys will figure it out. This one's my favorite. I didn't even see it. It's got little cherries on top. I love it. And this smells like total Christmas. I want to open it up right now. Maybe I'll go get in the jetted tub and do a bath cocktail. But I just... Oh my gosh, it smells like cherries. That's what it smells like, cherries. So thank you to Anne. I didn't even see these in the box. That's crazy. This is part of my birthday present. And then in here, she's got some neat little, you can see, whatever it is. These are all Christmas. Oh my gosh. Lovely. And then here's some more. These are like the old-fashioned candy she put in there. Oh, it smells fabulous. I love her soap. I use it down to the nubbin. And then here's another one. You can see. You guys need to check her website out. Make sure you say you saw it from me. She always throws something in. She is so sweet. I'm not quite sure which one this what this one is. It's like cocoa or something. But there's Bomb Your Body. So that is like, that's crazy. Look at all these bars of soap. And I didn't even see them in the drawer. Crazy. Okay. In the the so that that these four candles. Crazy. Oh, here's one in my lap. Okay. And then there's more in the bathroom in the bedroom that I will review tomorrow. Okay. So let's get going. I have a favorite candle. I love this one. This is Candy Cane Lane from Yankee Candles. Now I got this one for half half off. The best way to smell these is to open it and smell the lid. It smells like, oh my gosh, if I could get a scoop. And we have some custard in the fridge. It is uh, cookies and cream. But now they're starting to come out with a Christmas custard. You need to try it. It's by Dryers, and it's frozen custard, and it is so good. Um, if you need to put weight on... I bought it to make milkshakes, and it's frozen custard, and I thought, I don't know what that's going to taste like, but it is so good. So yeah, this is fabulous. I love this. This is from their treasure collection. So there's that. Okay, now, 
I'm going to go over real quick. Here is, I'm not sure if I blogged this or not. And I don't know if I took the Ulta stuff back or not. I guess I must have. I did not like that pink um, smell. This is candy cane, and it smells just like candy cane. Every year I go nuts over philosophy. I get the snow angel. I get all of them because it kind of perks you up, puts you in the holiday spirit, and yeah. Smells fabulous, absolutely fabulous. So there's that. Favorite. I'm going to put it in my. Here's my tub that we set on the edge of the. Or not my tub, but I love this. This is Tone with um, oil infusion, exotic argon, and marula oil. Or maruja oil. Oh, it smells fabulous and it makes your skin so soft. You can get this at Walmart for two eighty three. You will not regret it. So that's what it looks like. And they do come out with a Christmas scent. So um then here is the Bath and Body Works, fresh sparkling snow. Um and then yeah, I have three snowmen left from last year that I need to use. This one is a pot of gold. Um, they get kind of scratched up, but um, and then I have a, a lemon one somewhere. Oh, it's in that bag. But the pot of gold, oh, it smells fabulous. So there's what it looks like. Oh my gosh! I just take a big scoop out, put it on my bath puff, and yeah, it really suds up. And this is just a face wash. So those are my favorites. Four baths. Um, we could go on and on and on and on. Okay, now let's go to Lush, and then we will do a few candles, and I will be done. So, out of this year's launch, these are the ones that I still have. I need to go back and spend about $150 and get more of the new launch, which I'm going to do tonight. So, here's first snow. This is the talcum powder from last year. It's just about gone. Here's a snow fairy. It's a little dark. I'm not sure why. It hasn't been opened from last year. Here is a here's the hot toddy. It hasn't been opened from last year. I have so much luck. Here's the Holly Go Lightly. Holly Go Lightly. I figured why buy more? They're, they're not expired. Um Here's a Candy Mountain Bubble Bar. Looks just like this this year's. It's not crunched or anything. It's not out of date. Here's the Christmas Eve. Here's the Sunny Side. Here's the Butter Bear. These I'm a little leery with putting in the tub because they are bubble bars and they are silver. There's two of them. These are, are they Shoot for the Star? No, this is not Shoot for the Star. This is Starlight, Star Bright. So, um, I might do them in a giveaway. They are not ruined. I'm just a little worried about the pieces. I, I have so many bath products. I want to throw the whole thing in. Not good with the jetted tub. Trust me. Not good. I put a little corner in and it was bad. Here's Christmas Eve. It's a little bleached out, but it still works just the same. I try and take a bath every Christmas Eve with one of these, just kind of ritual. Anthony and I will get in the tub and candlelight. Here is Snow Fairy um, Sparkle. Now, I have not tried one of these in my jetted tub. I'm afraid that it will be like an artery, you know, like in your heart. When it gets warm, it'll like, you know, kind of dissolve. And then when it gets cold, it will clog. So I don't know about using one of these in the tub. If I do, it will be in a minute amount. So yeah, there it is. Snow Fairy. It's in perfect shape. Yeah. Here is Tender as a Night. And then they brought back some new soap. This is Reindeer Rock. That's brought back. Sarah Lynn's Cauldron. Not my favorite. The rest are massage bars. Yeah, they brought all these back. This is the 
Anthony doesn't like this. I think it smells just like men. I love it. Oh, I love it. It smells just like men's cologne. I can't. I'm going to have to rub it on his back when his back's hurting. Oh, I can't get him to use it. It smells so good. It smells like men's cologne. So when I'm done here, I'm going to get on and place. I love those lush. The they look um, rustic and they have the the anise. Not not they have cloves and they have like a wood stick and they just look really cute. And so do the um, magic fairy ones. They changed them a little bit. Now this one is um, this is the hot the what is it called? You you rub it and it gets hot. Not the hot toddy. It's, it'll come to me. You guys don't have to tell me. Um, it warms up, smells good. There's one that really gags me. I think is it called the Miranda? Yeah. So these I did a video on just massage bars. Then there is the the Per Cup. This one is the Per Cup. It's coffee. It's supposed to wake you up in the mornings. But I try not to get, I need to get these out. If I don't get them out, I'm not going to use them. So I need to get these out. And then I have a blog that uh, Joy and Karma, their face products, have asked me to review. And they've been up there for a year. I need to review them. This is a big solid conditioner. So after I upload this, I'm going to review their products. I've been telling them I'll do it, I'll do it, and it's not intentional. So here's the big solid conditioner. I prefer the sand stuff. I could not believe how soft it made my hair. But it does drip in color. So here is a... This is a Melted Snowman. Oh, it smells so good. Oh my gosh. So I'm probably only going to need to spend about a hundred on Christmas products because these are just, and then I save it for Boston Day. This one is Taka Taka and a facial pad. Now they don't carry these anymore. This is probably worth a lot of money. Yeah, I've never been used. They took this off. It's most fabulous. And then there's a toner tab in there. And then there's one more. I need to get a strawberry feels forever. I love that one. And then we are done with the last. But besides what's in the bedroom, this one is. I thought these were all Christmas. Yeah, they are. This one is a Yuban mango. You can barely touch it. Yeah. But if you have really dry skin, if you're in the hospital, it's great. Whoop. It's great to throw in your bag. And if you don't have time to like, you know, if you're in the hospital and you don't have time to rub lotion in, you can just rub it on your legs, you know, I put it on my face when I'm in the hospital, whatever, you feel like garbage, you feel like you stink, whatever, you don't stink, but I'm sure some people do, but whoa, anyway, so that is Lush Christmas so far, I, I put it back in and it fell to the bottom again, so, um, I need to get on. Every time I get on, it's sold out. I really want one of those sticks. Really. And then there's a really cute... I don't need the fun. Because I have two of those. They came in orange, black, and white last year. So, yeah. And then I have a whole bag full of fortune cookie soap. We won't get to it tonight. Because we are already at 34 minutes. So, I will get this uploading. Hope you guys enjoy this. Thanks for watching. This is my favorite. Wrap. I was going to do my candles. So this is Christmas in July from Fortune Cookie Soaps. Crazy. Yeah. Crazy. And then I have two gift boxes coming from them. Two. One for my mom, one for myself, or a girlfriend. So, and then I have some more left here. 
that I reviewed. Um, these are all new products. This is something to give me a sample of. And this is the one. Yeah, that's how much I put in the tub. And it went bonkers. Love it though. It smells so good. The sparkling pumpkin. I put half in there and it was crazy. Absolutely crazy. I had, to, I had to keep letting water out and putting water in. So I put way too much um, bubble bar in there. Learn my lesson. And this one is this one is the new Karma. Yeah, it really got thrashed, but it's beautiful and it smells so good. And I will do a video tomorrow on how to cut these up and how to store them and a store store them so they're aesthetically pleasing. They don't look really bad. Yeah, I will do that video tomorrow. I need to get just a lush knife. Um, it's really sharp. Otherwise, they crumble. So that's what these have been waiting for. Um, this was sixty dollars. This bag. This is uh, rough, rough with the smooth. And this is awesome. It smells fabulous. Oh my gosh, it smells like candy. It smells like candy. It does not look like candy. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. I think I'm going to take the whole thing in the shower and just scrub it down. I have so many products. So yeah. And then, yeah. And then this one is the new Sunny Side. They have a new shape. Yeah, from Lush. This is more of their Halloween launch. So, I need to get on an order from their Christmas launch. I hope you guys enjoy this. Thanks for watching. Love you all. Sub, sub, sub. Oh, I wanted to get my candle real quick. I know you guys love my favorites, so you'll watch them. I know you will. Okay, so I went over the candy cane philosophy. Love that. Okay, I'll clean this up later. So, now with the candles, I did not know that you could use a Victoria's Secret card at Bath and Body Works. Not a good thing. They shouldn't have told me that. Anyway, so this came, this is Ultra Soft Sugar Scrub Pumpkin Pie Spice. This is fabulous. It is um, just plain sugar. It's not really, it's not really abrasive, but it smells like pumpkin pie. It makes you want to eat it. it says do not eat because it can make you really sick. I mean, it's it's just sugar. That's all it is. So yeah, it smells like pumpkin pie. Fabulous. So yeah, I might go get a spray tan. I'm not looking real healthy there. Anyway, so I think the sheets are cute. Got a lot to go here. Got a lot to clean up. So, oh, candles. So, what I'm going to do with this is, this one's fine. It's, I don't see any blue. It's just um, bronzy and silver. I may spray this silver and um, go over the glitter with white. I will do a DIY on this because I didn't really want bronze. I wanted silver. So, yeah. But I wanted one that was elevated. You want to do things in, in odd numbers, and I got two, but I can always go back. So, this um, vanilla snowflake smells fabulous, but light blue is not normally a candle Oops. that you have at Christmas, but it smells fabulous. So what I do when I put these inside of these, I peel the label off just because it kind of takes away or I turn the candle holder around. Oh, it smells fabulous. Just, I would highly recommend. And then if you open the lid and you can't seem to get a scent, rub the wax like this. And that's how you can get it. So there's vanilla snowflake. They didn't have any winter candy apple out, apple yet out yet. So the holder was free. So it was buy one candle, second one was free, and then I had a coupon. 
I don't like the blue flower. That doesn't remind me of Christmas. So I'm going to go around and take a little paint brush and paint it red. Like an old makeup brush. And just paint it red and put some red glitter on it. So I will do that DIY with you tomorrow maybe. If you guys happen to get your hands on one of these, hey, if it's free, you can always fix it. So this one has the brush balsam. You cannot ha live at Christmas without one of these burning, just like leaves. Now she mentioned something about leaves coming out next year in a body care. Don't quote me. Okay, so with two more going and I will end this video. Um, this one is... Fresh sparkling snow does not really remind me of Christmas. I'll probably put it in the bathroom. It just smells, it smells like suntan lotion. I cannot believe it. I don't know what they were thinking. I really don't. I don't know what they were thinking. And then the last one is, this one's good. Candy cranberry. Love the packaging. Oh, and look at this. How cute is this? Let me shut my lights off. I don't know why. This was out in the living room. Why I drug it in here, but it's in here too soon. But where is my red lid? I bought some army pants and they make me they made me break out. I'm assuming from China and they had some kind of I don't know. They were really cute. I wore my um I'll have to wash them. But I wore my um hiking boots and a sweater and they were just really cute. So I just I think I just need to wash them. But I painted a lid. Where is it? I bought some red spray paint. And what I'm gonna do is go take this outside and paint this lid red and it just matches it looks really really cute I will do that DIY with you guys and then I have some white paint or some other things to do here this is a Krylon for outdoor furniture for barbecue stuff like that anyway, so let me get this uploaded before it gets any longer thanks for watching if you have any questions Give me a shout. Um, yeah, and I will ch clean up this chicken fried mess. Too many things to list. I hope you guys enjoyed this. It's my late October favorites. So, in my Luxor box, should be here any day. They gave me for the 95. I didn't get the Christmas box. I'm going to be upset if it's not Christmas related. It should be. I don't know why you should have to buy a separate Christmas box, but anyway. And then I have a couple big hauls for another couple other um, bath companies. So, yeah, we shall see. So, thanks for watching. Um, I will see you all later. And tomorrow I will do a, or later, maybe I will bring a knife and a cutting board in. I have one more video to do. You can do up to three. Um, I can show you how to cut those up and store them properly in GLAD containers or you can get the GLAD Christmas, um, so you know it's a Christmas product. Just grab it and you can write it on, write on it with a Sharpie like, uh, you know, you've been mangoed or whatever. That's not a Christmas product, but, um, so you'll know. But bomb your body. You just went out. Look at this one. That is amazing. Wow. So if you have any questions on how to get to her website, let me know. She's a wonderful woman, and tell her I sent you, and she will hook you up. Anyway, thank you for watching. Love you all. Sub, sub, sub. Give me a thumbs up, and I will subscribe back to you. And lots of stuff going on. Lots of stuff. So um, I also need to review this Joy and Karma. Poor girls have waited and waited and waited. This is a face treatment. Um, but I want to dedicate the video just to them, so, yeah, I will do this tomorrow. I have had it for months, my, my scent event, and then I've got Anthony's Jimmy Choo I need to review, so yeah, oh, here's the lid. So, I cleaned this one out, and 
I was going to put some sparklies in it, but look at the lid on this. It's crazy. Here it is. Look at that. Look at how much better that looks with a red lid. It's crazy. Just a simple, just spray it. Just simple. Yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you have any questions, comments, DIYs, let me know and I will get back to you. Love you all. Sub, sub, sub. Sorry it took 45 minutes. And I will see you all later. Have a good evening, and I will be back with possibly one more video. Love you all. Bye.